attending uh, meetings here the last seven years, all to uh, my avail. No one has done anything at all for Avon Way with all the accidents that occur on Avon Way. We have three every year. We had a garage destroyed recently. We have, we've had in the past children knocked down, adults knocked down, people cut from their cars. Yet I came along here three years ago. I asked the council to vote for safety precautions to be put near the children's play area. Absolutely nothing has been done. They actually refused to vote. I'm hoping, Madam Chairman, that you, you may, in the future, put forward a proper vote on behalf of Avon Way for proper safety precautions. A crossing, speed tables, rumble strip. Too many accidents, too many children involved, especially near play areas and schools. I know a few years ago we lost a little girl down at Lock -in simply because no one has done anything about road safety near schools and play areas. I do not want that on even Way. I have asked in the past, <coughs> the council have done absolutely nothing. I was hoping Mr. Terry, who lives near that park, would have done something, but he, he didn't even vote when I asked him to. The same for many other councillors on that day. So I'm still waiting something to be done on behalf of Avon Way. It's gone on far too long. We've been left in the dark. We've had 1,300 speeding offences every day recorded by the police in the past. We've had police on the road, detective vans, and all they do is collect money and all they are are short-term uh, methods. There is no long-term method. We don't want any children knocked down on that road. I've seen too much in the past in my job. It's just not good enough. It's time to cancel. Yes, the council did something about it. And I, tonight I've come along here just to say to you, Madam Chairman, Enough is enough for Avon Way. We've had enough. And also, we had a meeting here in Portishead with um, Sue Mount Stevens, mm. and she's very interested in any precaution to be undertook around schools and play areas in North Somerset. I asked for Mr. Apparis to come along tonight, and he sent me a rather rude reply, which I can't say here. I'm very disappointed in that. But anyway, enough is enough. Oh my God. Okay, thank you anyway, Chairman. That's enough from me. Well said, Mr. Holman.